The WA Energy Minister has joined state and federal leaders to try to work out a major new energy plan for Australia. The federal government wants to push power prices down and set new emissions targets, but the deal is far from guaranteed. Sydney was the venue for the Commonwealth's energy showdown with the states. Australian eyes are on this room today. Inside, ministers drew their battle lines. We have a range of concerns. We call on the Labor states to come on board. Outside, a handful of activists ran interference. Say no to the neg. But the main game is to strike a deal to guide investment in new electricity generation. To ensure that we are actually managing the transition from ageing generation fleet to new generation fleet. At the end of the talks about the National Energy Guarantee, everyone agreed to keep talking. Today we have made progress. We will take the next step. Going forward to the next step. But there's still more work to do to continue a process. Any step is a victory for the Federal Energy Minister. Today was a great day. So for all the talk of progress, there is still no deal. Victoria has not signed up to the National Energy Guarantee. Debate over the National Energy Guarantee now goes back to the Coalition party room and that won't be smooth sailing because some MPs, like former Prime Minister Tony Abbott, hate it because they say it's too green. But it should get majority support. Then the ball will be back in the court of the Labor states and their big fear is being branded as not green enough. As for our party room, Matt and I know there is strong support. Chrissy Ullman, Nine News.